As many of you know, I fish a lot of bucktails. Uh, last few years with my elbow being bad, I switched to bucktails almost exclusively as not to throw heavy plugs. And as I got more and more confident, I ended up using them better and better. And even when my elbow got better, I still use bucktails most of the time. I fished last night, I never, I had a full bag full of plugs and I never took the plug out. I was throwing a bucktail all night long and catching fish. Anyway, I wanted to, talk to you about these jig strips and what I want to really do is I just wanted to show you the underwater footage with jig strips compared to the original pork rind okay these are fat cow strips uh, they fit in my rock copper uh, pork rind bag perfectly um, I don't know what they made out of some kind of plastic or fabric or whatever it is. They have they have a split down the bottom. Uh, as far as the fishing, I caught just as many fish as I did on pork rind. When I heard that the pork rind were going to get discontinued, I kind of panicked. Went down to Kmart uh, in Penn Station after work, bought every damn jar that they had. Uh, people were laughing at me, but I love my pork rinds. And um, this product is has been very good. I had uh, on one pork rind. Jesus, about 100 bass before it just slipped off the hook. It didn't even break. Uh, I haven't caught a lot of bluefish, so I cannot tell you how durable they are with bluefish. Uh, but what I wanted to do in this video, if I can, if I manage to be able to do this right now, is to put underwater camera on a small bucktail just to give you uh, an action so you can see how different or similar is. I, I'm not sure what it is because I haven't done it yet. Uh, the difference between the fat cow uh, split tail and an uncle josh pork run which is not anymore being made obviously so you know i just got my little slimer here and then uh, saint croix i'm going to go down to the rip i'm going to make a few casts and um hopefully i get you some footage of underwater and maybe make some comments on it if it's necessary all right see you in a few minutes what you're looking at right now is an uncle josh pork run looks like a pink one it's fairly beaten up so it's supple you can see the way it's moving in the water i'm going to switch now over to fat cow strip this is right out of the jar you can see the action is just about the same i'm going to give you a side-by-side -side view where uncle josh is on the left and a fat cow is on the right i slow down a little bit so you can see a little better as you can see they almost identical um pretty good product um, so another option for you guys to use.